Hello, boys and girls, my name is Hotsusty, and welcome back to another day in Minecraft. We are here again, but as opposed to last time, the hole here on this side goes all the way down. So today we can build our creeper farm for... Um, Gunpowder farm number three. The first was uh, very manual over there uh, in the in the starting island. Then the other one over there not working that much better. But this one, this one should be great. But we need a bit more space here on this side. And then probably also an access chute that can go all the way down. So we can also access uh, the uh, slime form that we will eventually have here on this side. So I think I will take another chunk out of here so we have a bit more space and can accommodate for that. Now with a bit more space on the other side there, uh, we have one chunk or a bit more uh, down to bedrock and bedrock of course is spawn proof but we do have holes in here that do not really make for a good floor. So what we will do is uh, fill everything uh, up uh, to the one level uh, below and then uh, I can uh, place glass on there uh, because we want to make sure that uh, nothing uh, spawns in here. Uh, where, where we, we don't, don't want, want it. it and then we can build up the actual farm uh, and then we will have to make sure that uh, all the walls that are quite rough and have latches and edges uh, that are not lit up so things could spawn there that those are taken care of. I am thinking we need uh, to make uh, a wall up to, uh, to that level maybe basically all the way up uh, because uh, uh, we want to have uh, optimal conditions down here and this should then result in quite good rates. But let's finish this floor first. The collection system is very similar to the other creeper farm. We are using uh, water to flush them over the uh, campfires where they are dying. And then we have a hopper chain under here uh, which goes into this chest here. However, seeing that... Uh, my creepers do not fear cats. Um, we need something different here and I think we use water once again to flush them uh, off the platform down here and then they will die there in the middle. And this from being that low in the world that should help with really good uh, spawn rates um, given that we can make sure that 
there are no other spawning spots available uh, within this uh, area that is loaded so uh, yeah I guess the next step is building up the uh, the farm itself all spawning layer are now in and I think it's about 10 and uh, up here uh, there is a bit of redstone to uh, trigger the water flow and the way this works or supposed to work is uh, uh, the floors are alternating uh, flushed so we have one floor which is covered with water one floor not and that gives uh, opens up spawning spaces uh, for the creepers but i think what we still need to do is here uh, on the outside we have to build up uh, a wall because uh, if the creepers are pushed by water uh, they might uh, gain enough momentum so that they do not land in the water down there but overshoot and that's not what we want and then the final part is uh, going around uh, cleaning up the wall here uh, and lighting up all the uh, openings that are still there to improve spawning i figured the ideal afk spot for the farm down there is near the surface as that loads the whole farm but just the whole farm and uh, now it's actually time to see if this is working by turning it on uh, in here and the important thing is this comparator has to be on subtract mode so that every time the signal comes back it switches around and uh, every time um, we power this dropper here uh, that uh, basically uh, distracts the, the the water and then we get up here install us nice and cozy and wait for a few moments to see uh, if we actually get any creeper spawning as you can see from this short one hour time lapse it's already more efficient than the failed uh, attempt with cats uh, what we still need to do is uh, figure out the, the lighting issue so that we actually get better spawn rates in our farm and then we should have ideal conditions or at least it would not take too long to get all the gunpowder that we need and as we cannot mine in uh, this series we probably will need a bit more TNT uh, than on a usual run uh, but even that should not be a problem so we will continue with lighting up building up the walls in the next episode hope you enjoyed it if you did please consider leaving a like uh, and i will see you next time goodbye